folks. So I've managed to get this this Samsung DVD player hooked up to a YT 2009 instance. So what that means is we can um, look at things. Doesn't like these feeds, but I promise you. So if we do like a search and we search for, well, let's look at this person's search results first because they're great. Smurf episodes, Star Wars Kid, Star Wars Lego Funny. Um, we also want to see their watch history. Watch history is also great. Um, one moment. Look at that YouTube logo. I really like the design of this client, actually. Oh, here we are. I looked at me at the zoo, um, and then I was trying to watch Never Gonna Give You Up, and I realized that the left and right buttons are forward and backwards, and so I kept fumbling with things. Here's their original walk history. Walk, watch history, though. You know, these are the upload dates and not the uh, dates of the actual when they watched it. It would be nice to know when they watched it, but alas. Or it might be when they watched it, actually. I'm not sure. Don't know. Um, no, these are upload dates. Uh, anyways, we can uh, we can go to our search here, which I think we might have passed. So we'll go down a bit. Go down, but I have to control this with my TV remote, and I have to point at the TV, and it's a whole thing. Uh, we'll we'll do we'll do a search for Rickroll. Uh, it opens up the search query in the little keyboard. Instead of just searching for it directly. Gotta wait for that data to be received. Any day now. There we are. And we can watch Never Gonna Give You Up by Rick Astley. In just a moment. There we are. So we can scroll through the description. Apparently not hit the exit button. There goes the back button. As for how I got this done, it was a bit of pie hole. Uh, I had to set up a pie hole DNS server. I had to forward the gdata.youtube.com domain to uh, a, a YT 2009 instance, and then I also had to make um, this very strange online check. So I had to forward. Um, www.afternic.net to an IP that would just resolve uh, or return uh, 200. So I just opted for the local IP of my computer and that worked. I also had to do the same thing with www.yahoo.com and www.icq.com. For some reason, that's how it checks for online Venus. Uh, it doesn't like most of the preset feeds, but it can search for and play videos just fine. <laughs> 